asking his congregation to watch out. He says scammers are impersonating him. On KZI 9 is at 4 o'clock, we told you about how it's happening or been happening at St. Alice Parish for more than a year now. And now, as reporter Michael Severin shows us, the priest says he's not the only one being used. Michael? Yeah, Matt, Father Mark Benz tells me these scammers are not just targeting his flock. He believes priests all over the state are being impersonated. In the last few months, it's been happening with greater frequency, not just to me, but uh, a lot of, all, pretty much all, every priest in our area. Father Mark Benz is warning his flock after he says scammers have been posing as him online. He says the priest and nativity of the Mother of God Ukraine Catholic Church in Springfield has also been hit. Stories of it happening all over the place. So it's somebody who's got this idea of just impersonating a priest, setting up an email that looks kind of like their regular email. Here's how the scam works. Using a similar email address as the priest, scammers reach out to staff members and their congregation asking for money. Ben says sometimes they claim the money is for a friend who is sick and in the hospital, but it's all lies. Springfield resident Ron Satterfield tells me he's upset knowing that crooks would impersonate a trusted servant like a priest. If people respected each other and were honest, open, and fair, these things wouldn't even happen. Church officials tell me they would never send an email asking people for donations, but say that people can give online, by mail, and of course at mass using a collection basket like this. Benz isn't sure if anyone in his congregation has fallen for the scam. He's urging anyone who thinks they're being targeted to double check before sending money. If they need help, she'll come, come talk to us. We'll be happy to, to talk and see what we can do for you. And coming up at 6, hear how church officials at St. Alice Parish believe scammers got a hold of their data in the first place. Live in the studio, I'm Michael Severin, KEZI 9 News.